What's up guys, my name is Winner Singh. I hope you have an awesome day. Today is a rainy day, so I'm going to eat samosa. Well, samosa has always been the ultimate snack food for me. This sweet shop is a bit far from my house, but someone recommended me for samosas. They have a dine-in restaurant kind of menu, but I'm going to eat samosas. Here is my love, samosa. It's all-time favorite, triangle in shape, very sharp edges, and the price is rupees 10 only. It's fluffy, soft, as well as crispy. Let's crush the samosa. I love this noise. <laughs> it's potato, beans, paneer, coriander, and some spices. Let's top with the chutney. Chutney and samosa, it's always been the good combination. I am sitting in the dining area of this shop and I just paid rupees 10 for this samosa. I mean, that is a good deal. Oh yes, this chutney is awesome. Every bite needs a chutney. <laughs> Each and every potato cubes are equal and very fresh. Well, samosa is awesome, but chutney is always refreshing my mouth. <laughs> Let's eat this one bite samosa with the hands. And well, good thing about eating with your hands is it's add an extra taste to the food. <laughs> Well, samosa was really fantastic and now it's time for the tea and I always love to take the tea from the street vendors. This lady also have a snacks like rus, biscuits, mud tea, but I just want a tea. <laughs> My chai is going to be ready within a few seconds. Look at the smoke from the pan. Smell is really awesome. My chai is ready. Oh, thank you ma'am. This is Indian classical tea. It has a water, sugar, chai patti, ilachi, and a milk. It's of rupees 10 only. Yes, after a samosa, tea is important. Listening to the traffic, watching them to make the tea and take the tea is awesomely great feeling. Move on to the next. This man is selling the aloo tiki and golgappe and I'm gonna try aloo tiki. Let's see how he's making. He boiled the potatoes, add some spices, add the empty puris instead of a breadcrumbs. Some coriander leaves, it's fresh oil and freshly boiled potatoes. So first he take the boiled potatoes, make them into the round shaped ball and take the bit oil from the tawa and again press the round potato ball from the center and put them into the oil. My tikki is almost going to be ready, it's brown from the top, it will be very crispy. Another man is doing the duty of golgappes. He is making the holes in the tikki, maybe to add the more oil in the tikki. And that will be too oily, but it's okay. Cut from the center. Now it's time for the topping. It's reddish and onion. It's my favorite time topping of sauces and the yogurt. green spicy sauce tamarind sauce and now it's perfect aloo tiki <laughs> it's kind of chunky chaat masala so it's one tiki cost of rupees 10 only there is red sauce green sauce plain white yogurt onion radish let's try It's very hot, crispy, reddish kind of tikki because huge reddish on the top. Well, that's all for today. I total spent rupees 30 in a whole day and my stomach is now full. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, press the thumb button. And if you are not yet subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon so that you can get the notification first of my next video. God bless you and your family.